Hello guys, welcome to today's video. Well, today we have very good news and I'm filming with my new phone. Uh, how do you like the image? I'm actually... Uh, I am pretty impressed. It's it's pretty pr pretty nice image. But uh, I'm gonna get a call today or tomorrow that my car uh, new door is installed and also the new oil and new filter, new spark plugs, new screen wipers, everything. So that's gonna cost me a lot of money again. And good news, the side skirt has arrived. So it's now Thursday. So tomorrow painting, probably not. Should be great, but I don't think so. But probably Monday. So this Tuesday, I guess, or Wednesday, we are driving again like nothing happened, which I'm very, very happy about. And now I'm cruising in this Mercedes. I, I'm not, you know, I still prefer BMW, but I got to admit that this car is not bad. And the image of this phone is so freaking great, man. This is wide angle. And I mean, just look at it. No, you're not, you mother, motherfucker. Asshole. As I was saying before, I almost crashed into a truck. Um, the car today or tomorrow, I'm not sure yet, I'm gonna pick it up. And then I'm a happy person again. So, uh, yeah. And actually, just want to test out a new phone. And I like it. It looks way, way better as a previous phone. I'm still gonna use a GoPro more, but knowing that this camera is also that good it's nice to you know to do secondary things with it like filming on two angles and stuff like that so uh, yeah I am happy new phone is great cars almost ready so yeah I, I still hope there is not happening an accident soon because then I will probably lose my mind on that person <laughs> I hope not but yeah we'll see anyway you gotta admit though, I mean this screen and stuff like that looks pretty nice. You can see the tire pressure, uh, you can all change all these things. What model is this? I think it was a GLE. Drives very nice, uh, I, re I have to say. It's a new one for a customer. Um, yeah. It's pretty cool, I mean. And I can also, ooh, I can also change image. Oh shit! Look at that five times zoom, wide angle, normal two times zoom, five times zoom, and then I can zoom digitally up to twenty times. I mean, damn, it's almost. <laughs> can I read that? Almost, almost. Yeah, yeah, I can read it a little bit. Holy shit, man. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> so, as filming, I just got a phone call that the car will probably be ready today. So I can pick it up this evening. And then uh, we just have to make an appointment for a side skirt. I'm so happy. But I hope, you know, the paint has been done good. But they, they, these guys did my side skirts. And my... Um, they did my side skirts and my uh, front bumper so I don't think that they will do a bad job because those paint jobs have been pretty pretty good so I'm pretty confident that they will also have painted my doors like it should okay so we just got a call in this beautiful weather uh, that the car uh, is almost ready and I like can pick it up in like an hour so I'm a happy person so I can drop this car off. I have to refuel it first for the kilometers that I've driven, but I have only driven about 50, no, when I'm there, 70, 80. So uh, yeah, I'm uh, happy that the doors are getting fixed. The front one is, is installed and they, he's now almost ready with the, oh, shut up. He's almost ready with the rear one. So in like an hour I can pick up the car and I'm happy that I don't have to look at that damage anymore. So yeah, I still want to 
an automatic is so much easier flooring it. Oh, traction control was on. Why should it kick in in such a low horsepower car? Anyway, on our way to the store and then to the bimmer. Okay, so I just got a call and we are gonna pick up the bimmer. Uh, like I said, the doors are fixed and the side skirts are getting installed next week, uh, probably Thursday or Friday. So we still have to wait, an wait another week on them. But at least uh, the, the doors are replaced and that's all fine. But yeah, the, the damage is you know still there from the, the, the side skirt. But like I said, that's that's a five-minute job to install it, and uh, it's getting painted next uh, month. So uh, it's coming along. I mean, the doors were the biggest thing that hurt my soul, and they are replaced. That's ready, and yeah. We're getting there, we're not there yet, but we are getting there. As you can see, that's one of my doors that was pretty screwed up. You're not a part of the Bimmer anymore, man. Bye bye. Okay, so I picked the car back up and as you can see, we have the new doors installed. And the paint job on them looks absolutely amazing, so I'm very happy about that. I yet have to find some faults in the paint but the paint job is very very good and also the two small dents that were here are now gone because it's a completely new door um, we st the car is still not re ready yet we still have a lot of things to do like the side skirt is still busted that one is getting painted like I said already 50 times um, the needles you know the, the position of the door still has to be corrected a little bit like if you can see here this door is coming a bit more out than this one so we still have to correct that that's uh, that's getting done um, next time when the side skirts are uh, there this also still needs to get polished out but that will be arranged um, but also when they remove the window uh, from the, the old door to this door um, they fucked up my tint and yeah that sucks so that has to be redone and also previously uh, a friend of mine also if I see you can turn on the or I can turn on the lighting wide angle but here he also uh, you can see a little bit there's a you know a spot and so we are gonna retint this window. I'm already made an appointment for that. Uh, it's also very filthy. The only also there's another problem. Um, I'm gonna change. Um, let's see, flashlight. Oh, my battery is almost dead. Uh, but as you can see here, there is some um, kits from you know uh, on the door and also here. But we we can. Bus, you know, we can get it out, so that's not really a problem. I mean, uh, I mean, nothing is perfect, I guess, but yeah, that's we will clean that out. And you know, the f it's still a little bit filthy. I mean, like over here, um, yeah, the color was already filthy, but I'm gonna wait with cleaning that until everything is done. Uh, but there's also a problem with the rim, uh, so I got a hundred euros. They gave me a budget of 100 euros to fix the rim, and I'm like, okay, that's not enough. Um, yeah, like my rim over here is, you know, scuffed. Um, I'm probably like here the red. I'm probably going to, you know, fix that very cheaply. Like, uh, <laughs> we'll clean the wheel, and then we'll see how we're gonna do that. Um, but I'm thinking of selling the wheels because. I paid these wheels 300 euros, uh, let's get wide angle, I paid that wheel 300 euro, which is fine, uh, no, the, the, I mean the whole set, but I'm getting 100 euro to fix that, but it will cost around 200 euro to fix that. So I'm a little bit like skeptic about it, uh, why would I spend 200 euro to fix a rim on a set that I paid 300 euros for? So maybe I'm gonna sell these um, I mean they're, they're not cracked or bent or anyway they're just a little bit scuffed and maybe if I can sell them again for 300 euros then I haven't done a bad deal on them because my rear tires are bald 
almost and I'm just not gonna put on new tires on a set that I'm going to sell anyway because I will lose anyway on that on those tires so probably uh, I'm, I'm not sure yet what I'm gonna do maybe I'm gonna get a new set this summer when these are just really race slicks um, and they are just that fucked then I'm probably gonna do um, a new set of rims I'm not 100% sure yet I am still thinking about a few I have a few rims in mind still not 100% sure what I'm gonna do um, but first we are gonna get you know the, the tint is gonna get done um, I am making an appointment the guys you know searching when he can have a look then we are getting the doors aligned perfectly uh, the new side skirt is also getting done and then yeah the tint and except the rim then the car should be back in its original state so yeah we're gonna see what we're gonna do um, at least the doors are fixed so the biggest damage is gone now it's still you know putting a little bit work here and there making sure that everything is fixed but it has to be perfect because I cannot unsee what I saw what was not before and if it, if it if we can't get the car on point I'm gonna sell it that's just easy if, if I'm not gonna get everything as it was before then I don't want to keep this car I want a car to be perfect and if someone accidents my car and that's for any car I mean if someone damages my car fine but it has to be perfectly made and if it's not perfectly made then it's getting sold easy as that so um, that's a loud chicken anyway um, you know we're still in the repairing process I mean the biggest damage is finally fixed and then we're gonna see what we're gonna do like I said uh, door alignment a new side skirt and uh, polish the windy polish some stuff out anyway guys thanks for watching uh, I will keep you guys updated about the car at least the biggest damage is fixed and um, I mean, yeah, I, I mean, I'm happy that, you know, I don't have to look at it anymore. And it looks like there's a big difference in color, but that's not true. The, the panel is just dirty. Um, so, yeah, because uh, those guys already painted another, some other stuff. Anyway, guys, uh, thanks for watching for this video. Like I said, I will keep you guys updated. My doggy will say hello. And uh, I will see you guys very, very soon. Bye.